Look at this staircase. The staircase is wood with staples sticking out of it. Look at this nail right here. Look, I just pulled this nail out. And what do you do in the summer? Kids run around barefoot in the summer. Look how disgusting that is and how unsafe that is. Look at this carpet. It probably hasn't been vacuumed in 10 years. Look, there's some kind of hair there. It looks like crap on the floor. Look at the wall. Look how filthy the wall is. Look at the screw sticking out of the side. What the hell is that there for? I don't know where to start. The smell in this room is horrific. It smells like it was under the sea and somebody dried it off and put it in service. Oh, I don't even want to touch anything in this room. Oh, look at this bathroom. Look, it's coming off the wall. I don't have to peel it. Let me get a tissue. Oh, there's nothing in the tissue box. The blow dryer works. The one thing I need, it finally works. Look at the ceiling. They haven't fixed the ceiling since it's had a leak. It's all moldy, it's all disgusting. Look at the moisture in that ceiling. Look at the mold. That's where the smell's coming from. It's coming from the filthy carpet and the moldy ceiling. I just can't get over the smell. I can't even inspect this room anymore. You know what? I'll be right back. I keep this in my bag of tricks. This is my air quality monitor from Dylos. Anything above a 300 on this air quality monitor means the air in this room is dangerous. So all I gotta do is turn it on and see what happens. Look at that. It's over 10,000. Anything over 1,000 is poor. It means over 10,000. That's why the smell in this room is so bad. I'm here for one reason and one reason only, to help people. But they don't care, because if they cared, they wouldn't do this to guests. They wouldn't let a room like this be in existence. There's no way anybody that owns this rat hole gives a crap.